In today's cartoon story joke, we're about to take a wild ride through the whimsical world of farming. Picture this, farmers donning chef hats, playing matchmaker for pigs, and even outfitting cows with the latest in wearable tech. It's a hilarious hodgepodge of gourmet meals for cows, spa days for pigs, and a dash of Silicon Valley right in the barnyard. So, buckle up and prepare to be entertained as we delve into the comedic chaos of meat production strategies. Farmers get creative with animal diets, tweaking the grub to keep their critters happy and healthy. It's like a gourmet meal plan for cows. Keeping animals in tip-top shape is crucial for meat magic. Farmers play doctor with regular checkups, vaccinations, and even spa days for the livestock. Healthy cows make tasty burgers, after all. It's all about matchmaking on the farm. Farmers play Cupid, pairing up animals with the best gene is for maximum meatness. Who knew pigs had a dating scene? Farming meets the future with high-tech gadgets. From Fitbits for cows to automated feeding machines, it's like Silicon Valley moved to the barnyard. Who needs a smartphone when your cow has an iPad? When the meat market gets tough, farmers get creative. They dabble in everything from growing veggies to hosting farm tours. It's like a farmer's market meets Disneyland. Farmers aren't lone wolves. They're more like a big supportive family. They join forces with other farmers, industry groups, and even government agencies to tackle meaty challenges together. It's like a barnyard Avengers team ready to save the day. By mixing and matching these strategies, farmers can roll with the punches and keep the meat train chugging along, ensuring a steady supply of delicious goodies for us all. All right, folks, time to switch gears from serious to seriously hilarious. Put away your textbooks and get ready to dive headfirst into the deep end of laughter. It's joke time, where the punchlines are as golden as a chicken nugget on a Sunday morning. A farmer, eager to improve his herd, splurged on a top-of-the-range limousine cow at a prestigious auction. This cow was the cream of the crop, boasting genes that promised premium milk production and robust calves. The farmer envisioned a bright future of prosperity and success, with his prized cow leading the charge. However, much to his dismay, the cow's behavior left much to be desired when it came to matters of romance. Despite the farmer's best efforts to introduce her to the resident bull, she seemed utterly disinterested. No amount of coaxing or cajoling could persuade her to engage in any bovine bonding activities. Intrigued by the cow's peculiar behavior, the farmer sought the advice of the local vet, hoping for a solution to his romantic dilemma. The vet, renowned for his expertise in matters of animal behavior, arrived at the farm ready to crack the case. After observing the cow's standoffish antics and the bull's futile attempts at courtship, the vet couldn't help but chuckle knowingly. Ah, this cow, he mused, shaking his head in amusement. You see, my friend, this isn't just any ordinary bovine you've got here. This is a limousine cow, bred for excellence and superiority. The farmer's eyes widened with realization as the vet continued to unravel the mystery. Limousine cows are renowned for their discerning tastes and high standards, he explained. They simply won't settle for anything less than the best when it comes to choosing a mate. With a heavy heart, the farmer accepted the harsh reality that his prized cow was playing hard to get. But just when he thought things couldn't get any worse, the vet dropped a bombshell revelation that left him reeling. Does this cow happen to come from Douglas? The vet inquired, a knowing glint in his eye. The farmer, taken aback by the question, confirmed that indeed she did. Well, there's your answer, the vet chuckled. There is absolutely nothing you can do about this. I know this for a fact because my wife also hails from Douglas. <laughs> if you liked our joke, then please watch our next joke by clicking here.